Hello everybody, welcome to Road to Ferrari. We have jumped straight into the action this weekend at Canada. We have uh, jumped into qualifying. And you may notice this has just started to rain and so far we set our lap time with one sixteen three quick enough for pole. Um, but we are gonna carry on and on, on our slick tires on our option tires. Uh, we've gone a little bit faster through the first sector. So we've got a button in front of us on the intermediates. Maybe we've just gone by. Um, I'm pretty sure it still is slick conditions. Uh, you may notice the spray coming off the wheels. Uh, you may be thinking, what the hell are you on about? Um, well, I'm pretty sure it's it might be intermediate for right now, but the start of the lap it was probably dry, so that's the reason for um, still being on the slicks. And we're going to fly across the chicane, avoid the wall of champion, wall of champions nicely. Sorry about that. And across the line for seven percent faster that lap. Here we are towards the end. We've got Michael Schumacher in the second, uh, three seconds behind us. Um, um, so, yeah. We've got Michael behind us, Felipe in third, and Rosberg in fourth. And the lights are coming on to start this Canadian Grand Prix with the sun shining. You can see the heat haze in the distance. And we are away. Michael can try and go around our outside, but we're not going to have any of it. Can cut him off. Put the engine into fast. Oh, a bit of tap on the wall there. So, we've kept them away so far into this section of the track. So, with our qualifying advantage, even though it was mixed conditions, I'm pretty sure we are very fast around this track, especially going into the last chicane. Compared to everybody on the grid, we seem to be able to take so much more speed into that final chicane. Um, it does feel a bit like cheating, if I'm honest with you. So, coming down the back straight now to that chicane, um, you're going to see what I mean. If you look at the map now, you'll be able to see what's like speed we can carry through and that means we get carry more we get more like a uh, more speed down the straight so we have a pretty decent lead so far with Michael Schumacher uh, and I'm not sure what happened to Michael I think he might have pitted the lap before but Luxi is now in second followed by Hamilton and Aljuswari so we're gonna pit on lap number nine uh, as you can see on the map that is the gap we have insane uh, we have got a bit of front wing damage. I'm pretty sure I picked that up. Um, bit, uh, earlier on on this lap before we pitted. Um, so X in the pits now. Will we have Leopsi to worry about? To, wor to, blah, 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 to worry about. Uh, so we should slow down there before we come out the pits. But no, we don't. We have got. Quite a big gap to Leo, see. Um, got Heike Kovalainen, who we are going to lap coming on to the last lap because nothing happened. We literally led and dominated this race that we are. Um, we were even lapping cars. Um, so, yeah. Pretty good race so far, if you ask me. Get a bit of a warning for cutting corner then. Uh, is that a red car I can see him from? It is! What? There's a Ferrari doing down here. Uh, not very good really, is it? 
Who is it? It's Fernando. Whoa. What's Fernando doing all the way down here? In P17. In fact, we can't really talk. We've had races like that too. Along with Schumacher as well. Obviously, Schumacher was leading towards the start, so I'm not sure what's happening with these two. Uh, so, Michael will have blue flags, so should lift off the power and let us through, even though we're going straight and it shouldn't really hurt us that much. And we've got a car in front of us now, out of Suarez. It's got another one that was quite high up as well, all tailed off, but we have won the Canadian Grand Prix, probably the quickest video you've ever seen for career mode, but I'm not going to show you a boring race, what is the point in that? I'm just going to show you the, what happened. So yeah, 47 seconds the lead we had over the next car. Uh, that was a really, really good race. We pretty much made no, we made no mistakes apart from that bit where the front wing came off. Uh, championship leader Felipe Massa finished fourth. So good result from Felipe. Uh, so he's still scoring double points, 12 points in fourth. Rumours Barrichello are going to pick out as well. He's also doing well in the Williams. He's sixth in the championship, which is good for the Williams. Um, yeah, getting closer to Felipe and Nico. There's only three points separating them, and then we're a couple more points behind. And we're third in the constructors. So, here we are for the a questions. Really victory today and maximum points towards your championship challenge. Have you thought if about winning the title? You um, about the title? If I race like that every race, then yes, we could probably win the title. But unfortunately, sometimes it just doesn't happen a like that. First place finish. Your teammate must be starting to fear for his seniority within the a clear victory. There. Uh, the car, which maybe we are beating Mark every now and then. Progresses. You must have given some thought to winning the title by now. Uh, yeah, we're going to push and make it happen. Get Ferrari to notice us a bit more. But yeah, next race is Valencia. Um, be sure to join us. It's been a very short race. Uh, if you're enjoying the season so far, please make sure you hit the like button. Comment down below, because I do enjoy reading the comments. I had a nice comment on the first episode. Uh, and it makes me quite happy to see that people are enjoying them. Um, and I really enjoy playing the old games like a lot. Because this is pretty much my childhood, F1 2010. And I literally love it to bits. Um, so yeah. Thank you for watching Road to Ferrari. It means a hell of a lot. Um, I will see you in Valencia. Where hopefully we can have another win. Because it would definitely help us out in the championship. And maybe get Ferrari to notice us. But that might be pushing our luck just yet. But thank you for watching. I will see you later. And goodbye.